the issue of global climate change is, in my judgment, the most profound issue of our time. The costs are going to be huge. Uh, you know, look, the most important cost is life itself. If we do not do anything, that is when our life systems will be in danger of, of extinction. Making change in the, at the University of California is this huge bureaucracy is, is more difficult than turning around an aircraft carrier. The business of uh, providing energy and oil and gasoline to everybody is big business, one of the world's biggest big businesses. And they don't want to hear this signal because uh, it's going to affect their bottom line. The next thing people say is, yeah, it's huge, it's impossible, it's so big, but there's nothing we can do about it, it's just going to be the way it is. That's never the case. We can always fix these problems. The age of, um, we can just throw anything away and we can throw any kind of, we can dump anything in any ocean or any river we want because it's just fine and because that's what the company wants to do, those days are done. I'm told that we have something like a window of significantly less than a decade to take those actions which will have purchase to them, which will actually take hold and have effect. I am here to facilitate you, the community, deciding how we are going to permanently institutionalize sustainability on this campus. The greater that all the students um, can really commit to a process of working together, it's going to forward the movement. The more divisive things become, or, or the more distance things become, we weaken relationships. This is one of the coolest places in the world. I mean, Santa Cruz rocks. These, the, the, the beaches, the mountains, the trees. This is one of the coolest places in the world. Let's keep it that way. Put down your fair trade, child-friendly, shade-grown, micro-credit-funded, decaf, low-fat, roibos, acai, cashew, ginseng, chai, <laughs> which you drink in the non-GMO cornstarch cup you, you reuse 12 times, <laughs> and show the world the UC Santa Cruz way to live lightly and sustainably. How do we find a way to build an institution that is really sustainable? We have an inborn sense of ethics. This can be explored in the university and virtually no place else, to my knowledge. To bring this issue, which is on everyone's mind, everyone's lips, everyone's thoughts, everyone's anxiety level, and somehow translate that into real action. By moving a, a referendum forward and seeing if the student response is there, and if it is, we have a great opportunity to further make sustainability real with tangible hands-on programs. Within our communities, within our lives, within our households, we have infinite opportunities for action and for change. We have to become one with nature and recognize that without it, we'll die. You remember it? Come on. Green, green, it's green, they say, on the far side of the Everybody, come on. Green, green, I'm going away to where the grass is green as hell. We can make a huge impact, and so we have to rewrite uh, how we function.